Hello everyone, in this video, we are going to see how to install and create a website using GPT Engineer. To install GPT Engineer, you need a server or computer with Python installed and is executable uh, using Python command. Uh, in this video, we are using Google Cloud Server to try GPT Engineer. You can refer to our website for all the commands we are going to use. We have provided the link in description. Please check it out. But first, we can check and confirm whether we have Python and the version we are using. Um, you should see the output something like this. So this confirms that we have Python and is working properly from command line. Uh, create a sim link if you need to make Python command work from the command line. Um, now you can run Python using Python command uh, to install GPT Engineer. First, we need to install uh, some packages for smooth functioning of Python. Now let us install Python virtual environment now we have successfully installed the required packages. Uh, now let us create a project directory using this command and then navigate to your directory, a clone the GPT engineer repository from GitHub using this command. Um, now we can install GPT engineer. If our installation is successful, you should see something like this. Now we can activate the, uh, the virtual environment. Um, let us configure the open AI API key, which GPT engineer uses to generate the Python script. Now let us try to create a website with our GPT engineer. Uh, GPT engineer uh, provides a prompt file which is available in the uh, projects folder. Um, there is a example folder by default, which contains a, a sample project. Uh, you can rename the folder as you wish. Now we can edit the prompt file and add the prompt to create the website. After changing the prompt file, now we can launch GPT engineer with the following command. After launching the GPT engineer, it will ask us for clarification like style themes and other details. Um, you can provide the necessary clarifications, or we can type C to move on without providing any clarification. Now it will start to generate the files and scripts that are necessary for the website. Uh, and then it'll just take some time to generate those scripts. So we need to wait till the process completes. Once the files are generated, GPT engineer will provide the commands to make our website live. We can also use GPT engineer to run those command. And there can be errors because GPT engineer relies on chat GPT for the scripts to create the website files. Um, so if you face any error, you can fix them manually and run the file again manually to view the website created by GPT engineer. Um, we hope you found this video helpful. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.